Okay, you're watching the Passion Fruit Walrus play Life is Strange Before the Storm. And uh, this is a game I haven't played before, so uh, see what happens. Don't know why there's an Illuminati uh, triangle thing there. Okay. Someone's got a death wish. Yeah, let's smoke on railway lines at night. That's a really, really good idea. I can't believe Firewalk is playing a show at the old mill. Fuck yes! Okay. Mom would kill me if she knew I was out here. Yeah, probably not, though. Mothers don't usually kill their children, especially not for being out at night. Right, and I need to change uh, the Y axis. Yes, good, okay. Okay, good. Well, she looks alright, I suppose. But still kind of an arsehole so far. Fence. Thank you for pointing that out to me. I'd never have noticed that that was a fence. No trespassing? No way. Okay. Oh, come on. Holy shit. Well, it's a shitty old warehouse. This place is awesome. It's not the word I'd use to describe it. If I'm going to get inside, I'll have to get through that door. I mean, that looks like the kind of place you just... Who the hell would want to go there? I mean, it's run down, it's dirty, it's... Probably full of drugged up people and fucking... Like, rapists and stuff. Okay, that what's this then? That looks ancient. I wonder how long ago the mill actually closed. Quite some time, by the look of it. Okay then, so we've got to sneak through the front door apparently. Train car? An old lumber car. Guess it's been years since anyone's actually worked here. Yeah. Seems likely. Hello, buddy. I've got to figure out how to get past this guy. Help you, miss. You gotta let me in. Check it. I'm totally legit. Yeah, people who are totally legit don't say that. It's not a bad fake, kid, but you're in over your head here. Do yourself a favor and scram. Can't let him push me around. Should I go back and stand up to him? Or can something around here help me convince him? Okay, so some random shit will... Nothing says badass like a nice floral print. Yeah, well, it's quite a badass bike, even if it's got flowers on it. Besides, what's not badass about flowers? I'd join a motorcycle gang. If I had any friends. And a motorcycle. This place has collected a lot of junk over the years. Mm-hmm. Second door inside. So close, and yet so far. 
So presumably she can't get in. Oh, she can listen. Okay. This band shreds so hard. I gotta get in there. What the hell does shreds mean? You mean they play well? Okay. Um. So we got a fire. Maybe we can burn. So oh, I can throw fuel on the fire. Okay. <laughs> I guess fire safety isn't exactly high on the agenda here. Well, it's an illegal rave or something in an abandoned factory. It's hardly likely to have like big health and safety guidelines this and stuff. Just begging for a little street art. But if I do it here, someone will see me. Exactly right. Okay. <laughs> Meaning you. Yeah. Those guys need to get a room. Damn. Mind your own business. I understand. I understand, really. And, and, and it won't ever happen again. I swear. You can trust me. I promise. I really get it now. Okay. Some, uh, some nice friendly characters there. Right. A bonfire. Some say the world will end in fire. And some in ice and so on, yeah, but, uh, so what? Mom would totally flip her shit if she knew I hiked for an hour just to see a show. How exactly would one flip this one's place shit? This is sketchy as hell. An old abandoned building in the middle of nowhere, miles from home. And yet you're still there. <laughs> home. Right. Now I remember why I'm here. Any place is better than home. Well, if that's true, then there is literally every other place that you could be, apart from home and that place. Okay. We have pondered. Now what? Um, ba -dum -ba -dum. Do I just have to shout at this doorman guy? Because it doesn't... Oh, okay. Have we got a, something I can do stuff with? Ah, perfect place for me to work. Now what to draw? Not a meth lab. Free candy? Um... Oh, let's do the meth lab, that sounds funnier. Absolutely not a meth lab. Okay. Um. Okay. Some people. S right, okay, I'll give this a read, shall we? Uh, so you know how I stopped going to class so much? Like you stopped talking to me so much. Funny story, I had trouble coming up with an excuse, so I just didn't. I didn't show up. And it was fine, nobody said anything to me crazy, right? It's like I'm invincible all of a sudden. Maybe that's the perk of being the dead dad girl. No one knows what to do with me, so they're actually relieved when I stay home. Okay also means that they're completely ignoring you and leaving you to rot, which isn't really helpful. I uh, wish I'd figured this out sooner. Think of all the wasted school time. Yeah, because it's really a waste getting an education, assuming they actually teach you something useful at this school. Which possibly they don't, seeing as you're at an illegal rave and thingy. But anyway. Uh, P.S. Pris from Blade Runner popped into my head last time I rubbed one. Okay. I mean, at first I was thinking about Deckard and that smolder of his, but then Pris just totally stole the show. Probably nothing there. I think I just want her bangs. Chloe the Electric Sheep. That sounds a bit... superficial. I mean, why would you think about... hairstyles when you masturbate? That sounds mental. Okay then, uh, yep, okay. 
Uh, have I do I need to look at what I've drawn or is that it? I'm sorry, officer. It says what on the side of my RV? Okay. So do I now go and tell him that someone's written on his RV? Is that all I have to do? Or do I just have to set something on fire? God. Again? What do you want, kid? What do you think she wants? Uh Okay. Okay, try the bike. Is that your bike over there? Yep. It's uh pretty cool. Gee, thanks. Is that all? Ah, oh, blimey, come on. This is the old mill, right? I heard Firewalk is playing here tonight. They're awesome. Nope. Are you kidding? You should probably just go. Ah, oh, fuck it. Let's see if she gets beaten up. Started a back talk challenge. What the fuck is that? Okay. I have to convince this doorstop that I'm not giving up until he lets me inside. In back talk, you use arguments and insults to get someone to do what you want. Yeah, somehow that doesn't really seem very likely to me, but okay. Uh, okay. Don't you remember what it's like to be a teenager? I just want to see the band. I thought we went over this. Isn't it past your bedtime? Bedtime. Uh, does he pay attention to what the opponent says? Bedtime. Okay. Alright. So he said bedtime, so what? Mm. Okay, so I suppose we got to be juvenile and say your bedtime. Aww. Isn't it past yours? <laughs> Real cute. But I still don't know you. Okay. So cute. I don't do cute. Uh fine, let's let's be stroppy, shall we? Look at my face. Do I look cute? Or do I look like I'm going to kick your ass? <laughs> <laughs> okay. You're right, you're gonna kick his ass. Uh, playground. Um, why is it doing that? Okay, let's just go for playground. Maybe I am a kid, because this place looks like a damn playground to me. A girl like you? I can't protect you in there. Isn't that your job? Uh, I'm not worried. What happens to me is my business. Let me worry about that. My, my boss will kill me if I let you in. That's your problem. Bosses suck. Screw the man and fuck the rules, dude. <laughs> okay. You're funny. But that's not the point. Hmm... No, you can't spell fun without F U. You're, you're not accepting no for an answer, are you? Nope. <laughs> and you really think you can take me? Yeah. No. What if I had a knife? No problem. A gun? Don't care. What if I had You could have a flamethrower, an army of robot ninjas, and a motherfucking dragon on a leash in there, and I'd still kick your ass. <laughs> I give up. <laughs> you're all right, kid. Go on in. Seriously, you're a bouncer. Just bounce her ass the fuck out of there. What kind of bouncer are you, you... Ah, oh, pathetic. Okay. Strange people. The bird looks all right, though. Flappy, flappy in the corner. This is intense. Oh, shit! Hey, Delia, come. Cute dog. 
Yeah, really cute. If you like lethal critters, don't touch my soul with your dirty hands. What? Okay. Just follow the lights and the sound. Can't wait to get in there and thrash. <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> that dog is fierce. Okay, yeah, well, we're not petting it then, are we? Oh, look, a drunk. What a surprise. Sober up, girl. You're missing the show. Yeah, I think you missed the, uh, the reason most of the people are there. Don't mess with Damon. Thanks for the memo. Who's Damon Merrick, and why should I care? Look, we have to send us up exactly. That shirt is rad. Okay. Uh, well, I don't think we want to take it right in front of him. Is that guy selling merch? Wish I had some cash. So can we distract him? Hey, are you selling any bucks? What? Twenty bucks for a T-shirt. That's really expensive. No, that's pretty normal. Quite frankly, that actually sounds fairly cheap to me, really. Sweet knife. Just like the one my mom refused to get me for my birthday. <laughs> what the fuck were you gonna do with it anyway? Sketch Central. Yeah, well you're in an abandoned where uh, sawmill. Graffiti everywhere. Is there? I don't see any. Spot. Yeah, go on then. What are you looking at? Okay. Strange. Okay. Oh, look, a drunk guy. Sweet dreams, hombre. Okay. This is a classy joint. Damn, there are a lot of people here. Well, I see three, but okay. Cold beer, free for the taking. I'll take it then. So does she have like a drunkenness Drink meter? Feel less. Yes, please. Yeah, that sounds like really, really healthy attitude to take. Okay. Okay, right, so we got her. How can you just chill when Firewalk is tearing it up in the next room? Well, that's probably why she came, to sort of relax, enjoy Frank the music. Bowers? What is he doing here? Does it matter? Yeah, Frank! Hey! Stoned. Chloe? I know your name, you idiot. You bought pot for me every month for a year. Look at that get up. <laughs> Studs. You're trying too hard. What are you even doing here? I'm here to see Firewalk, man. They rock. How'd you even hear about this little shindig? God, the internet. How else? What of mouse? Fucking kids. Magazines? Fuck knows. Uh, right. Oh well, ask for some weed then if he's dealing. Okay. She's obviously so destructive. I could definitely use something to take the edge off. Because that beer of wasn't course. enough. As soon as you give me the hundred and seventy-five bucks you owe me. <laughs> Shit. Do I really owe him that much? Unless I find some quick cash around here, I can kiss my high goodbye. How about you spot me some? You know I'm good for it. <laughs> no way. I learned my lesson last time. Money first. Yeah. Seriously, why are you even giving out free weed? Are you nuts? Right, okay. Well, I think we'll uh, stop there for the moment and we'll come back uh, later on with some more and we'll uh, see how that goes. Uh, thank you for watching and bye-bye for now.